Hey, how's it going everyone? I hope that you're all having an amazing day. This video we are going to really quickly go over some controller setting tips for Hyperscape. If you were like me and were having a hard time aiming with your controller in Hyperscape yesterday, then hopefully these couple of tips can really help you out, but let's get right into it. I am not going to tell you exactly what you need to set your sensitivities at, because that is something that you really need to figure out for yourself you need to go and figure out what sensitivities will allow you to balance both reaction time and precision aim. Which leads me into my first tip, which is that you need to spend a decent amount of time in the practice range, testing out what sensitivities work best for you. Thankfully, Hyperscape does have a training range, which is located behind the portal that takes you to the playlists. In this range, you have access to all of the weapons and it is here where you need to find your sensitivity balance. The weapon that I recommend most for figuring out your sensitivity is the Riot 1. This pistol is a single fire pistol which is good because the way that you are going to want to test your sensitivity is by flicking your aim between targets for each and every single shot. The Riot 1 also has a good hip fire reticle and a good aim down sights reticle which helps out because if you go to flick your aim to another target and you overshoot that target consistently, that is probably a good sign that you need to turn your sensitivity down. One thing that I really want to stress is that you need to turn your vertical sensitivity down lower than your horizontal sensitivity. Hyperscape's vertical sensitivity is insane, and when I finally decided and figured out that I needed to tank my vertical sensitivity, it improved my aim by 300%. Lowering your vertical sensitivity will make aiming feel a little bit more natural and a lot less chaotic. So if you are like I was and you are just flailing your reticle all over the place, then you need to try turning your vertical sensitivity way down. One last very important tip that I want to go over is Hyperscape's ADS sensitivity settings. So in most cases, this number right here would reflect a percentage of your regular hip fire sensitivity. So if your ADS settings are at 70%, then you should be at 70% of your normal sensitivity when you are aiming down the sights. I however do not think that this is the case in Hyperscape. At least it is very hard for me to tell. But you can see here that I have my horizontal sensitivity set all the way down to 15 and my ADS sensitivity set to 100. So in theory, the sensitivity speed should be the same whether I'm aiming down sights or not. But in my opinion, you can see a clear rise in speed here, which is something to definitely take note of. In my opinion, I would go through and test your ADS sensitivity the same exact way that you tested your regular hip fire sensitivity, just to be sure that your sensitivities are exactly where you want them. Those are both of the tips that I have for your Hyperscape controller settings and after lowering my vertical sensitivity I noticed a huge difference in the amount of shots that I was landing. Let me know down in the comments if you guys have any extra tips so that we can all get better together and hit the like button if this helped you out. Other than that I hope you all have an amazing day. I'm out.